That is a little more than 30 years ago. I did share the opinion that defense will not work, that once you have rockets, <laughs> defense is really not effective. The situation deeply disturbed me at that time. And by 1963, I gave testimony to the U.S. Senate arguing for defensive measures and stating, which I believe to be true and still believe to be true, that the Soviet Union very rightly did work on defense, and so should we. Excuse me, there's a word that, again, these words are very interesting. There's a word that bewilders me here, which is the, dif the word defense. Because what I'm picking up from you is that if, if the deterrence factor right, is inherently unstable and has to be so superseded by something else, right, then I don't understand the meaning of this word defense because the, the, the thing that supersedes, it seems to me, an aggression. Excuse me. I tried to make it very simple, very plain. By defense, I mean defense. What is it? I mean stopping the rockets, not aggression. There is a political solution to stopping the rocket, surely. Uh, why don't you participate in that? May I please express a slight doubt mm. in the stability of the political solution. It might work, but we have tried it for a long period. I do not believe that purely technical means will succeed. I do believe that as long as only, and please take what I say literally, as long as we talk only about weapons of attack, political solutions will be very hard to find. If we can develop methods of defense, not weapons of mass destruction, but weapons aimed at the weapons of mass destruction, anti-weapons. If we can develop these, then we could be in a more stable situation. Now let me complete this argument in a few words. I think I know. I have not, I cannot have complete knowledge and I don't. But I think I know that the Soviet Union has worked diligently and effectively on weapons of defense. The West has not. That was a mistake. I believe that the word Star Wars that attempts to ridicule our defensive efforts is not quite appropriate. I believe strategic defense initiative is also not appropriate. So because the initiative there. has been taken by the Soviets, all is strategic defense response. But in what we are proposing, there is an element of an initiative. And that is, as President Reagan said quite explicitly, on many occasions. We are not simply trying to develop defense for the United States. We are trying to develop defensive systems together with everyone who is willing to cooperate. And a defense based on such cooperation could indeed lead to a more stable situation. I'm sorry, it was not easy to say that more. No, I understand, no problem. Sergio Kapitza. Yes.